In Alice in Wonderland, scale plays an important role. We see the mushroom forest from the perspective of a 6 inch tall Alice. 3D previous models were used on set for real time feedback. Concept art and a library of reference images helped to achieve the realism we were after. A large number of different mushrooms as well as plants were modeled and textured. A look was developed using in-house shaders and the Arnold renderer, which allowed us to model transmission of light. A variation system allowed us to dial in shape and look variations. Mushrooms and plants were laid out on a ground plane, mimicking the set used on stage. Characters on the plates were carefully matched, such as the Tweedles, to allow us to integrate the facial expressions. Leaves and debris were sprinkled on the virtual set by FX artists. The CG and live action characters interact with the leaves as well as the wind. As we come closer to the caterpillar, fog and smoke become denser. Multiple simulations of fog and smoke are layered on top of the render and footage. In the closer shots of Absalom, the storyboards called for more articulate smoke. After animation, FX artists simulated and rendered smoke using our in-house renderer Sphia. Who are you? Absalom? You're not Absalom, I'm Absalom. The question is... Who are you? 